Hello everyone, we hope you're all doing very well. It's mid-February 2021, we're in the A4E Skyhawk in version 2.0.0 and we now have labs bombing implemented labs low altitude bombing system what this is going to allow us to do is attack a target from a distance in a dive convey to a computer system where we want that bomb to drop then allow us to pull up and in the pull up the computer will release the bomb and the bomb will then fly to the target hit the target by which time we could have pulled out and turned away so it's allowing us to put a bomb on a target where we don't have to fly over the target we've got a target here a really heavily defended target that we need to hit relatively accurately we've got about 20 23 mil cannons all set to maximum skill and maximum readiness so that's not an easy target to fly over and we've got to take that bridge out we've got myself here we've got Cartana here say hello hey how's it going Hello there. Um, and we've got a Mark 84 each dumb bomb that we want to put on that target. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is in a minute, I'm going to unpause. We're going to show this the switchology that we need to get ready. Then I'm going to follow Cortana in for a typical run. And we'll talk about the parameters as we go. Uh, and that's it. So the procedure for the actual drop is we will run in on the target in a relatively shallow dive. We will have the Pippa there position on the target and keep it on the target at a predetermined distance from the target which will be essentially be judged by eye we will press and hold bomb release button there and we will not release that until the bomb has dropped at that point the lab's light will come on there that's when it's doing its calculations as to when to drop the bomb and as soon as we've pressed and held the button we're also going to aft stick to pull up the best way we like to do it is to pull up so that this part of the uh, reticle stays on the target so the target which is currently there if you see will work its way down the crosshair there that way we can keep it laterally correct while our nose pitches up and that brings us to the question of a how steep we dive on the target and b how harshly we pull up Cortana do you want to handle that honestly it's going to be very situational if you're dropping in from high and you've got a very small target you're trying to hit it might be good to have a steeper dive angle but what you need to keep in mind is that you still need to maintain that gentle pull up so chances are you're going to end up getting a lot closer to the target so that might be appropriate for something like a bunker that you're trying to hit with a mark 84 for anything that's like so in this case we've got a bridge right so because it has length to it we don't necessarily need to come in at a steep angle we can sort of focus on having that gentle dive and gentle pull up which will give us the accurate accuracy we need horizontally and because the bridge has length to it we don't necessarily care that we're that we might be plus or minus right. you know 150 feet or so yeah, and that, and that kind of brings us into our very last point that, that we're dealing with a really old kind of 60s computer system. And therefore, we also want to give the computer time for it to do the calculations. So harsh pull-ups and harsh dives are going to upset it. Okay, what we're going to do now is unpause. We're going to look at the switchology and I'm going to follow Cortana, Cortana in and we will drop our Mark 84s. Stick off and master arm on. Function selector labs arm the rele relevant uh, station bomb arm right click twice to arm nose tail uh, that's that there and over to the radar because this is going to involve the radar right click air to ground that's me set up okay we can pretty much go near full power if you want the way we see it is that the faster we go the further we can toss this bomb and the less you know the the the, the further away from the target which is what we're all about here staying away from those deadly uh, 23 mils. Right, so I'm a little bit left for the lineup with the bridge. Yeah, Roger. Setting my trim as well to neutral for speed is going to help a lot. All right, starting my shallow dive. Diving. All right, and I've got it pressed and pulling out. Up is pressed and pulling out. And bombs away. Up. Bomb away. Turn away so we don't go over the target. Full power. I'm watching. And yes! Beautiful. And second bomb. Two perfect hits. Absolutely wonderful. And the most important thing is, well, A, it was accurate, which I didn't actually expect. And B, they never even got a shot off because we were so fast and we dropped, you know, 
a mile away. So that was really, really cool. Anything you want to add to that Cortana? Only thing I would add is that this can only be used with slick and um, cluster munitions. It cannot be used with high drag bombs. Roger, good call. Right, I hope you enjoyed that and see you later.